Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Fortress Craft Evolve. So today we're going to try to go underground here and get some materials. Uh, it wants us to build a laboratory. Okay, you know what? We need to chill for a minute before we start building laboratories here. So let's go ahead and get our pinger thingy out and, oh, scanned. And we saw something before. I don't know how deep that is considered though. Uh, but it definitely looks worth grabbing. And I think digging down is not a bad idea to to be honest. Um, I kind of wanted something a little closer because I want to like I want to like work my way down but maybe that's just the way to do it. Uh, we do have the auto stepping. Oh that was weird. You guys saw that crazy sideways thing didn't you? Okay so let's work our way down and see what we can come up with shall we? Now the further you go down uh, probably won't be a problem right away uh, but you hit things like it gets hotter, colder, uh, I think there's poison event uh, effects, there's even radiation of effects. There's quite a few naughty things that can happen while digging down. So you have to keep that in mind and note that uh, you might uh, be going a little too far if you're starting to hit some hazards. I think there's also like you can't mine at a certain point too because you need like upgraded um, builder gun here to be able to mine through it, things like that. So. Um, yeah, so it has like a, you know, like if you think of like Minecraft, you kind of progress uh, in a weird style. You don't really progress downwards. Um, I guess you kind of wee bit with like diamonds you can't use. You know, like wood or something to mine diamonds. But in the sense, it's just more like it's an RPG and everything is everywhere kind of thing. Uh, though you can go to other places like the end, the nether. Here, it's more about progression downwards. You keep working your way down, 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 which I think is really cool and something I wish I would see more in video games. And that's one of my favorite parts about this game is that's exactly what you can do here. So I'm happy it exists. So I'm assuming this might be iron, but it's taking us a bit to get down there. Oh yeah. Um, we have problems because our suit gets really cold really fast. There isn't much I can do about it yet. Besides coming up and down. I wonder if... I know we have the suit upgrades, but I don't think there's a suit pack. You need iron and lithium, never mind. I was like, I wonder if, eh, and it was like, no, no, never mind. I mean, we could reduce the light completely. I'll reduce some, but it's still going to be cold digging down, right? So I think you still get uh, some light too down underground, so that's kind of cool. What you can do is you can stand still too in certain parts, so... It might get cold uh, the further you get down, but you can put a torch down, of course. And there you go. And they have a different uh, look to them when you're, uh, you know, when you're working your way down. Right now, I'm probably too cold or too hot there for a minute. I was on top of it, right? So, uh, so let's get back our scanner, anyways. There we go. Oh God, more power. The research laboratory. It's very hungry. Oh, this has popped up already when you guys are off, and I was like, oh, that's too bad. That's something that you guys probably wanted. Oh, there you go. Wow. What is making it disappear almost instantaneous now? Oh, well. Uh, G? Yeah. Ooh, crap. We're in a cavern. So, I'm just thinking what I want to do here. I was hoping to hit the thing by now, but we didn't get it. Uh, let's do another scan then. That's like right there. But not right there. Let's go back to building mode then. Um, we're going to work our way down, I think, on purpose here. 
at least till we can. Just thinking how I want to do this right now. Let's jump down here and see what we're doing here. So let's hit the scan again. I don't want to do the scan again, but the scan says it's right in front of me. You gotta be kidding me. That's not iron, is it? It's just another material. Oops. I think it's just another hard material and we just got screwed over. Okay. So, uh, let's get that scanned anyways. It's like a hard rock probably or something. Bedrock! Oh, aren't you a badass? Okay, that did not work out so well, did it? We're not even close to that thing anyways. Still showing something here even though I'm pretty sure there's nothing left here. We just scanned that though. Even shows it's still new but we already did it. Yeah, well we'll build through it, cut through it I guess. Uh, use a scanner M to find iron. Dick. What is this thing? Uh, ping Nonor, ping air. We'll have to get rid of this because it's annoying, right? I mean, we could keep pinging it, but... Oh, there's another one here. Uh, let's grab this before we go up, just in case it's another crappy ore, right? Or not a crappy ore, a crappy material. Wait, is this... This could be iron ore, finally. Whew! That ping thing is a bit of a, a mess, isn't it? I'll take what I can get, right? So if this is iron, I'll be super happy. So let's go ahead and we'll select this. And we'll super build over here. Yeah. Super build over here. Awesome. Oops, I meant to left click. I guess we can left click right there. There you go. So I'm thinking this is, uh, we probably should scan it, huh? I'm assuming this is what we want. What I'm hoping to do here is, uh, eventually we can get the power down there, but, uh, what we can do is there's a distance so you can power things down there rather than doing it up here bring coal or find coal around there and you don't have to do it there but eventually it's nice to have your power system go all the way down there so if you don't want to deal with the eh, logistics right away uh, it's probably best to uh, do the power stuff there so uh, I'm getting excited here hoping this is iron that was whatever iron ore we found it awesome so let's go ahead and create at least one of these to see how it works out 
So I was telling you there's other ways to get power, of course, and that is through the generator, which... What would the generator be under? Oh, here it is, at the top. Oh, it requires iron. <laughs> of course. Uh, so I want to fix this on my way down anyway, so we're going to... We're going to go ahead and fix this up a bit. Oh, no, there's uh, materials in the way there, so we'll have to ignore that one for now. But basically, I'm just spam right-clicking going down here. Uh, nice to open this up so I don't hit my head as often. Oh, I just took out a torch. Let's go down here. There you go. Oh, just took out one of my stairs. Bad stairs. Okay. So was there iron near... Or no, yeah, there's coal right there, actually. So coal's like two feet away, which is awesome for this setup. I'll go over here. Now, I might not have enough miners yet for this, but uh, at least, yeah, we can use that cool. Now, there's an efficiency for the generators themselves. The deeper you go underground, the less oxygen uh, they can breathe, basically, and they choke themselves out. So uh, you need to uh, just be wary of that. If you go too deep, then they're kind of worthless. So, But I think at this level, they will work just fine. Might have some efficiency problems. So let's go ahead and place down ourselves our last uh, drill right here. And uh, it's out of power, so we'll give it some power. Now the only downside right here is we literally have no hoppers. Basically we need iron for hoppers, so we're kind of running low here. Oh good, my guy filled me up with power. I was kind of worried I'd have to run back. Might be worth giving it a bit more power anyways, and then hopping back up. Yeah, we'll let it do its thing while we hop back up. And then we'll make our way up. Oh, crap. Well, we made it up a lot faster anyways with our new uh, stair changes. So let's go up here and grab some more power. There we go. Oh yeah, it's like build the, the generator. It's like, eh, I need to process some of that iron first, buddy. Let's go here. Clear this up a bit more. This will end up being like a main stairwell, right? So might as well do it nicely here. Add a bit more power to it. There we go. Wait, is that 20 iron in there already? Oh, damn. How much iron do you pick up each time? Oh, two. Okay, we'll work our way back up now. Oop, did not mean to hit that one. I meant to hit our thing, but we're like rocking up here really fast now. Damn. Okay, so we need to figure out how we're gonna add the iron in here. Can I just butt in there? Okay, I think what I'm going to have to do, unfortunately, is I'm going to have to turn this off to locked. There you go. And then I think I can take the iron and throw it in there now. There we go. That'll do it. And then I guess I should grab some of this. Unfortunately, he's powering me up with his energy he built up over time, which is something I didn't want to do, but yeah, whatever. I mean, it's not going to take it long to actually get that done, so I could just grab the iron bars now, go down with the generator. Though, uh, actually, probably the hopper would be the best thing right now. Yeah, I probably should wait for the hopper instead and then do the generator. Because going back and forth anyways, I'm going to get enough power to power it for probably a wee bit anyways. Right now, the generator, or the, uh, sorry, the hopper would be the, the most beneficial thing, I think, so... Why do you want me to interact with it? Oh, it's pissed off because I unchanged the mode on it. That <laughs> sucker. Okay, so let's go back to the hopper here. Actually, I wonder if you can build the hopper just like this. 
Oh no, you have to craft it. I was just wondering. There's a mini hopper. Stores 10 resources. Oh, that's cute. Honestly, if it doesn't do what I want it to do, I probably wouldn't want it. There you go. Okay. So we got our hopper. We'll work our way back down. Holy crap. I didn't realize we'd fly down here. I wonder if he's changed the mechanics. It just feel a lot faster than I would have a long time ago. Okay. We'll put down the hopper down. And then there you go. Nice. And of course, since we're down here, might as well give it the power. But like I said, it shouldn't eat that much power to begin with, so. There you go. And we can give it more iron. And we're golden for iron. But uh, what you might want to do once you get the power running and everything down there is actually build the, um, basically make the miner everything down there. No need to do it up here, right? Just do it all down there. And uh, then th that way you get fresh ingots out of it. So you kind of condense them a bit, uh, two for one or whatever. Uh, I think if you had a harder difficulty, you would get a lot more out of it, of course, but yeah. Oh yeah, you need the tin plates, the basic PCB, all that stuff. So maybe that'll be next time. I know I was thinking of working on it soon, but um, things have changed over time. Let's do the threat scanner. I don't know where the threat scanner has to be or... There you go. I don't know if the th threat scanner requires power. Base rating, approximate 33. Oh yeah, it has power. No threats detected. At one point it says, hey, you should build one. Okay. Oh, there's upslope. Oh. Used to transport items upslopes almost twice as fast as a conveyor belt. Oh, so that kind of fixes the derp of the sloping. Huh. That's kind of handy and smart. Oh yeah, there's Arthur upgrades actually. Anything I could want, I was gonna say want or could use. Eight times charge, he can transfer to you when you're running low. Oh, craft that for sure. What about Arthur's solar panel? Oh wait, did I put suit upgrades in the wrong spot or was that for Arthur only now I think about it? Oh, I'm an idiot. S suit upgrades. Oh, what about Arthur upgrades? I should ask. Is the suit upgrades inventory same for? Anyways, we got an upgrade for him. So I'm happy about that. Moustache. Oh, this is cute. Okay, so I guess it works as a extended inventory with uh, a whitelist. So basically, if you can put it in that inventory, uh, then it works. So like, if you try to put this in here and it doesn't go in there, you, then you can't do it. You can't do that. But if it can go in there, then it it, it can work there. So 
uh, it works for him. So that's kind of cool. That'll give him a little extra energy, uh, which is good when you go down deep or whatever. Though it takes a while for him uh, to, you know, power up and stuff. But that's good. I like that. So we were looking at the generator anyways. Uh, we're probably ready for the uh, iron probably a long time ago, but we were slow. And uh, one thing we wanted to do, which, which, why can't we do it again? I forget. Oh, well, we need the ore extractor, which is going to be a lot more iron. Splat. <laughs> I like when you hear the splat sounds. Oh, yeah, it was the this stuff here, which I said I'll just do another time. Okay. So you go open this, boom, you can fill this with more power. And then somewhere around here, I want to put this down here, but you want to, I guess it doesn't really matter, right? Just thinking how I want to lay this down. So this is the power core eventually, I guess we'll just put it here, there you go, and then Oh, apparently it can't function this deep at all. Okay, there you go. So now you have... Uh, I told you that it's possible things couldn't work at this level. This cannot work at this level, period. So that is that is some good information, I guess. Um, I wasn't sure it if it would work or not. But yeah, so efficiency is 40%. So basically we hit a level where it just isn't worth it. 10% right there. Okay, yeah, so you wouldn't want to run it there. I wasn't sure if you could run it that deep or if it was like, if it was like really deep, it became useless. But it's cool that, that that's a thing. It wants you to use the laser system, wants you to build them down below, you know, it wants you to do a little effort for it. So that that's not bad. I don't mind that at all. Uh, so we can throw these guys in here. There you go. Wait, oh, yeah, yeah, because yeah, there's a certain limit, of course, right? So you could say uh, remove only. Oh yeah, you can switch this over here. So remove only. And eventually just switch these over or whatever. So uh, we'll call that an episode. Next episode we'll probably make a couple other things. We'll get uh, some resources up. I'll probably start working on our power line system down there, things like that. And then we'll go from there. So thank you guys and girls so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.